Look at that. The disrespect. You think this chicken wanted to be eaten looking like this? No. Like, you gonna, you gonna cook me. Don't burn me. I mean, this, like I said, this fell into the fire. That's what it looks like. We've been to some of the best barbecue spots on this channel, but today we are going to the worst barbecue spot in our area. Yes, that's right. We're standing right outside of Grayton Casino located in Rona Park, California. And this barbecue joint got one and a half stars on Yelp. We're about to go inside, order some food. And we're gonna see if this place is as bad as they say. So come along. Before we go in really quick, I wanna read some Yelp reviews. So that way you know what we're working with. Oh my God, this was the worst barbecue ever dry like a piece of wood even though they drowned it in sauce their Oakland location is way better okay so they have an Oakland location do yourself a favor and skip this jerky joint I think the staff was drier than the meat long faces and not a positive vibe you never under any circumstance only give one napkin with barbecue no. are you kidding me with this there should be a roll of paper towels at the table yeah, oh, one napkin is a no-go. That is a pet peeve. Let's take a look at some of the pictures really quick. So this is of some chicken. It looks like dry chicken, but look at all this sauce on here. I mean, it, is, it looks like almost a soup situation. So they put a ton of barbecue sauce. I'm a saucy girl. I don't mind that. But, um, you know, it's all about is this chicken moist or is it dry? So we'll see. This next one of the green beans. I mean, those look pretty overly cooked and i don't know they look like they could have come out of the can <laughs> i'm just saying they look like they could have come out of the can but we'll see it's all about the flavor of the green beans right okay this mac and cheese doesn't look bad it doesn't look bad i don't think it looks like that dry maybe a little bit but it also looks like it has some like greasy kind of oiliness to it but let's go inside let's get this food let's see if it's really as bad as they say so you guys are back in the car. So we got a lunch and a dinner combo. Real quick, I just wanna say the price point here, okay? So we got a lunch situation and it basically comes with the beef links and you have to get potato salad. You have nothing, no other choice of a side. Yeah. So you have to get, you can pick one meat and the potato salad you have to get and it comes with bread. Um, anyways, that was $17. And then I also got a three-way combo, which is a dinner situation. That's this one. And that's ribs, brisket, chicken. And the two sides we chose are mac and cheese and green beans. Comes with bread as well. That was $33. We also got a fountain drink for $3.50. This totaled with tax $58.42. Yeah. <laughs> okay, before we start this, uh, we show you guys what we got. A couple things that we noticed. First off, taking this out of the bag, look how saucy this is. You guys, this might as well have been just, they might, might as well just thrown water in here. And this is the lunch yeah. box. Exactly. <laughs> and it's funny, in the Yelp review, somebody said, oh, they only gave me one napkin. Now, hold on, before you show it. Okay. <laughs> one napkin is bad. It's terrible, especially with, come on, look how much sauce this is. Even if we ate inside of there, it's too much. But what's worse about it, it's not even one napkin. It's this thing, you guys. Now this thing works, but it's like this isn't even like a strong napkin. No. Isn't even a strong napkin. No, it's one of these puny napkins. So it's terrible. That's all you get. Now they did give us three wipes. Yeah, they get that's gonna be a lifesaver. At least we have wipes. <laughs> okay, good. But let's show what this is. You wanna do dinner first or lunch? Let's show lunch first. Okay. So here you go, guys. This is the amazing lunch special for $17. <laughs> Sorry about that. No worries. $17 and something cents. So first off, they smashed this sausage. <laughs> the guy couldn't wait. He could just threw it in there. <laughs> so it's all smashed. It's smashed. There's the mac and cheese we're gonna, or potato salad. We're going to try it. Um, they did also give us each two slices of wheat bread, like we said in the, in the Yelp review. Should be white bread, but it's wheat. It's all good. So, yeah. So, the two slices of wheat bread comes with this. Yep. Uh, they just put it on the side. But let's see how these links taste. They even put, like, the... I mean, this is... Is that the edge of the... Thing. It's hard. Oh gosh, it looks like an alien. It does. <laughs> it does. It almost looks like an alien. All right. Okay, let's just try this. All right, let's I see mean, if it's good. I like things saucy. And it smells good. I got a medium sauce too on this one. Let's see. Mm. That's right, yeah. Thank mm. you. Very 
Let's try it too. Very smoky. Like this thing's been smoked and choked and doked and poked <laughs> for like for days. This thing's been this thing's been in it. In yeah. it. Why is it so overly smoky? Hell of smoke. Like not. Yeah. Um, it, okay, so first off, it's not horrible. No. It's just that 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 smoke is so smoky. I've never had anything that smoky before. Never mind. It tastes like maybe this thing went into the fire. Yeah. <laughs> and was cooked. Went into the fire. Not, it was off the grill, into the fire. Into the fire to observe. Mm-hmm. The, the, observe and report. Because it does taste like, I taste like I'm tasting ash. Yeah. Right? Yeah. <laughs> no, this thing was observing and reporting inside the fire pit, for sure. <laughs> and it came out. No, that's not hidden. That's not hidden. Yeah, but it's yeah. not terrible. It's just that it's weird. The barbecue sauce is kind of like vinegary sauce, you know? The barbecue is fine. I actually enjoy the barbecue sauce. Nah, try it by itself. I'm sorry. You got to try okay. it by itself. If you said you enjoy it, it's because you didn't try it by itself. No, you said it wasn't bad. Well, it's not bad in the sense where it's like never want to eat it ever again. Exactly. It actually isn't really good by itself. <laughs> I know. I know. It's not. Oh. It's very vinegary. Yeah. It, it it just tastes like it's been thrown together. It doesn't taste like it's been really worked on. Okay, let's try this potato salad. The one option you get. So there you guys go. That's the potato salad. It's not not starting off strong, but you know, it, it could get better. It could get better. Here we go. <laughs> That's the face you make. We have some disgusting potato salad. And I love potato salad. Mm. Not this though. Man. This is really bad. It's definitely very sour. Oh, very sour. Um oh. not pleasant. That's like if grandma had a really hard day <laughs> and just kind of gave up on life. <laughs> and wasn't <laughs> you know what I mean? And wasn't trying to care about her grandkids and her kids mm -hmm. on the cookout. I mean that's grandma like like uh, boy, together. boycotting yeah. life. That's what that is. She threw it together for sure. Definitely did not put enough mayo and enough love in that into that. Right, much. exactly. Grandma has boycotted mm. the situation. All right, here you go, guys. So this, by the way, this is really hard eating this in the car. It is. So that right there is the dinner plate. So this is thirty three dollars, you guys. You get a few ribs. Maybe it looks like two. It looks like three, four ribs. Uh, you get some brisket, brisket out of there and chicken, some chicken. All sauced up. Literally, they just threw it in there, threw sauce on there. Two pieces of wheat bread. Two pieces of wheat you bread. You should have white. I think we all know this if we have barbecue, but wheat exactly. bread. Exactly. Mac and cheese and green beans. All right, I'll let you go first. What do you want to try? I really don't want to try it. <laughs> but I want to try this. Can I try yeah, a side? Go, go for the mac and cheese. Oh, oh. <laughs> You guys, it's like a rock. It's a rock. How'd you know? I saw it. I saw it all go together. It is a rock. Yeah. Like a rock. Here, I got a fork. <laughs> <laughs> like a rock. Oh, uh, okay. it's pretty bad. Man, you guys, I'm not kidding. It's, there's a, no. It's. <laughs> it's all coming together. It won't leave. This is definitely not fresh. I'm going to tell you this right now. No, it's now. not. This is pre, this is cooked from like two days ago. Yeah, this is definitely two day ago meal. Okay, let's. All right. I want you to enjoy every single bite of that. I want you to love it. No? You guys, mac and cheese, when it's done right, it's the it's one of the greatest things in the world. And the way Kristen's nodding her head. No, um, I have a... It's, oh. You guys, this is two-day-old leftover mac and cheese. I, we came right when they opened at noon. This is not fresh from this today. This might be last week. Yeah. It's it's not new. This might be made last Thanksgiving. Mm -hmm. Wow. No, I'm not kidding. It's dry. It's it looks like it's like it's mac and cheese you take from your refrigerator and you nuke it in the microwave yeah. Yeah. for 20 seconds, a little underdone, so it's not hot and melted. Yeah. Just a little warm. That's, yeah, that's that. what that is. Let's try these green beans. All right, the green beans were in the in the yelp too, so maybe maybe I got hope for the green bean. <laughs> I had hope. I had hope. I'm squeaking as I'm eating it. Oh. Okay. I gotta say, it's bad, but they're not <laughs> terrible. They're not terrible. 
It is. It's definitely been there. They cooked these for sure yesterday yeah. at the, at at least. Yeah. Um, it's a little too salty. Um, is it overly done? Is that why it just melted in my mouth? Yes. <laughs> it, it shouldn't melt, I guess. So they're overcooked. With a little bit of a squeak. And actually over seasoned, which I'm surprised. And over seasoned, yeah. They're very, very salty. <gasps> Excuse me. All right, let's go for this brisket. Let's just do it. Okay. Let's just get into it, you guys. I'll take a piece too. I'm going for brisket. So bad. I don't mind the brisket. Mm hmm. Once again, the barbecue sauce by itself, not great. Mm -mm. But the brisket definitely melts. Melts in your mouth pretty well. Not too, not dry. Definitely not dry. No. I feel like it's been soaking in this barbecue sauce, probably. Mm -hmm. um, but it, the flavor is actually pretty good on it. It's not, it's smoky, but it's not as smoky as those links were. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. it's not as bad. That's exactly right. But it also doesn't seem like the freshest. Yeah, it doesn't seem like that. Um, but it's... Well, it's not bad. It's not terrible. But it's not good. Mm -hmm. It needs to be juicier, but yeah. the barbecue sauce makes it... And they don't give you a whole lot. I mean, yeah. I mean, there's a little bit left, but that's okay because you at least got the ribs and the chicken over here. I'll be honest. Yeah. I don't want to try the ribs or the chicken. No, you're going. We're going all the way. We are here to review the worst <laughs> okay. reviewed place on our barbecue in our area. Mm -hmm. And here you go. Some cold ribs. <laughs> are they oh, cold? They are cold. Oh, gosh, these are cold. You guys, these are ice cold. Ice cold ribs in the morning. How does that sound? These are ice cold. Oh, that's somebody's shoe. Yeah. Tastes like a shoe. Yeah. Yeah. With barbecue sauce on it. Yep. Yeah. Right? It's leather. It's torn. It's ripped. It tastes like leather. Yeah. Oh, that's bad. Oh, man, you guys. That's leather. <laughs> when we get back to Las Vegas, we're going to back to Jesse Ray's. Yeah. Which is our favorite barbecue spot. Way, and way we're better. we're getting it. That straight up tastes like a shoe. Like if I were to take a shoe, take it, put some, soak some barbecue sauce on there, all right, and Way put it in the oven smoky. for a little bit. I can barely chew this thing. Yeah, yeah. Unpleasant. You want to try that chicken? <sighs> we gotta go for the chicken. Here, you can take this one. So it looks. First like off. <laughs> I can't even talk. I can't talk. Look at that. The disrespect. <laughs> You think this chicken wanted to be eaten looking like this? No. <laughs> like, you gonna, <laughs> gonna cook me. <laughs> Don't burn me. I mean, this, th like I said, this fell into the fire. That's what it looks like. Looks like it fell into the fire. Look at that. Are you guys seeing that? What is that? Is that skin? Uh, yes. Yes, it's skin. It looks. Yes. Okay, well, I was gonna offer this to you, but I got a feeling you're not gonna eat that. <laughs> So they give you a leg and it looks like a breast. A breast too, yeah. Just have a bite. Just can we let's, Okay. Let's wrap it up. Let's wrap the situation. Up. Show them show what it looks like. That's the inside, guys. <laughs> looks a little dry. Ooh. Really? It's not a little dry. Do you want me to try it? This guy hated us. I know what happened. <laughs> they hate their customers. <laughs> That guy, by the way, the lady taking our order, she was nice, perfectly <laughs> fine. Yeah. But the guy there hated. He was not happy. The chopper of the meat and the yeah. assemble, the assembling of the food. He was very angry. I don't know why, but he you could just tell. We got there and we were like, "Can we get um?" I want to try this. What I have to? Oh yeah, you oh oh you have to. Let's have Kristen try this. <laughs> Oh my god! It's, it's like, terrible. It's like sandpaper. Yeah, or that's no. It's, it's like, not sandpaper. It's it's like a towel. Sure, sure. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> why not? That's a really good description. It's a towel. Do we need to try the stupid wheat bread? I don't think so. I mean, okay, you guys, this is wheat bread. It's dumb. I, I don't know. Again, like if it's white, that's what it's supposed to be. It's wheat. Okay, well... It's dumb. I don't even want to try it, but it's sweet bread. Is that everything? Did we really just, like, lose 40, 50 bucks on this? That was it, babe. 
Wow. Yep, that was it. Okay. Really quick. Yes, this place is worth one star. Yeah. It's one and a half on Yelp. I give it a one. I give it a one. It's disgusting. Yeah. But brisket was the only thing that was partially acceptable. Yeah. Um, I, I'm still chewing the chicken. <laughs> <laughs> drive I just feel like don't do it yeah just don't do it don't come with a barbecue spot for one don't call it barbecue and don't come with a spot unless it's really good you know and this is bad I want that guy I want to go back in there <laughs> with this chicken and be like try that yeah and this guy you try that the worker you know he knows what good barbecue is of course yes I he want to does. talk to him on the DL and be like dude yeah, that dude knows. Let's be real. Yeah, this guy, you could just tell the worker knew what good barbecue was and he knew he was not making it. Yeah. Not even close. No. Not even close. Not even decent barbecue. I would have been, had we not known about this place. Yeah. Which, by the way, um, we were told that this was the best barbecue. We were. That's how we found out about this place. We were told that this was the best barbecue. Yes. In, I think, California at, or something. Lady at our hotel said, hey, there's the best barbecue joint yeah. at the casino. It's new. Check it out. And we and we were like, great. Let me yelp it. Exactly. Let me see what they have. <laughs> immediately. Immediately saw one and a half stars. Saw some pictures, read some reviews, and I knew that chick did not know what she was talking about. I don't think she had gone there, though. No, she said she hadn't gone there. Okay. So well. she didn't know. She This was just what she had heard. Yeah. She wasn't, you know, she was just like, hey, you guys are in town. Check it out. Mm -hmm. It's supposed to be like the best barbecue. It's new. It's supposed to be amazing. Well, it's not. <laughs> you guys, I mean, that was... That was I, I promise you we were not... <laughs> making up anything by the way both of those barbecue sauces were the same heat so yeah they did not get a mild and a medium they were like the same they were the same whatever it was yeah it's probably mild but man it doesn't that's the least of our problems that chicken was like you know <laughs> if, if, it's tough it was, it wasn't trying to leave maybe, the bone yeah <laughs> <laughs> you know if you're gonna if we're going to you know eat animals yeah. and it's true let's have let's, Respect do, let's do it justice yes do it let's, right. let's have it. <laughs> no animal wants to be eat it, eaten and it's like not good yes yeah, so let's have the easy. animal be proud of their of the product you know it's like <laughs> this animal is not proud yeah it's not exactly. it's not the animal's fault trust me it's yeah. not you guys saw it yeah it like a cast was on it or something <laughs> <laughs> like a scab was forming <laughs> That's what it looked like. Looked like a full scab. Oh, okay. You guys, well, now it, that we roasted that place. Yeah, <laughs> it deserves one and a half stars. Factoid. Yes. Don't come here. Don't come here. Even though we haven't said the name, you guys, oh, out yeah. of respect for the place, we won't say we the name. We have not said the name. But you can always look it up. I'm sure you can find it. Yeah, you guys are smart people. Yeah. But we're not going to say it. Yes. But uh, if you do find out what it is, don't come here. <sighs> Please don't. Fair warning. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Definitely a warning. <laughs> Do not say we did not warn you. You saw that chicken. I, need, I needed help. <laughs> yeah. All right, you guys. Okay, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, share, and just care. Let your friends really know what the Kate and JFM are doing. And until next time, we hope you have a wonderful day, evening, or night. Whatever time it is out there, we will see you on our next video. Mm -hmm. Peace. Peace out,